Hey y'all, what's up? Welcome back to Seashell. Yeah, I know I look a little blurry, but I think it's, I don't know if it's my camera or what, but anyway, y'all, good morning. How y'all doing? I just came on here and eat a little breakfast with y'all. I'm having a um, bacon, egg, and sausage McMuffin, two of them with cheese, and I got me some um, Honey Nut Cheerios right here. And the only reason I'm eating the cereal, y'all, because I got to hurry up and um, use this milk that I'm always wasting. But anyway, y'all, let's go ahead and say our grace. God is good. God is great. Let us thank you for our food by our head. Share faith. Give us Lord our daily bread. Amen. Amen, brothers and sisters. Anyway, if you haven't already subscribed to my channel, go hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, hit the notification bell, tell your friends to tell their friends, and we can be friends, you know. But y'all, I ain't too long woke up. I just felt like eating some breakfast this morning. Y'all, and that, if y'all go and look at that challenge from last night, the McDonough Mega, Mega, um, Pounder Meal Challenge, I could have just ate the meat. I don't know what I was thinking about, because I couldn't eat the last bite. So, it's all good, though. And then I got up this morning, my cat don't came and ate it. Mm -hmm. so, So, well, I got some turkey bacon and beef bacon, too. There we go. Go ahead and do my thumbnail. Mmm. Now, these are better than McDonald's, Burger King, Bojangles. These are better than they make muffins. It tastes just like that, but better. You know, I gotta fix my light in some way. I don't know. I noticed on my video last night it was blurry. I don't know if it was. I don't know. I gotta sit. What I was doing on this good Thursday. Don't forget, it's almost the weekend, baby. For real. Yeah, I did not feel like taking this off my head. Because I probably go end up dozing back off to about 1 or 2. 1 or 2 o'clock ain't nothing to do. So I know I'm going to either, you know, watching movies and falling asleep. Or just watching movies and not going to sleep. Uh, T. It's gonna be hot today, y'all, because I'm burning up already, so. I'm probably just going to eat a bowl enough to finish this milk out. Mm. I put too much cheese on it. 
That's all right. Probably because I had it in the freezer and it wouldn't separate, so I just put it on there. <laughs> That's a lot of cheese. Mm -hmm. Swallow. Oh, I called my phone. It was a telemarketer or a job site. <laughs> I guess it didn't mess my video up, but the, the other one that messed my video up was Facebook Messenger. Yeah, I hate to say it, but your girl going back to sleep. It's 11 o'clock. Now, I'm just saying it ain't nothing to do. Too much care for turkey bacon, though. It's all right, but. Mm -mm. I'm gonna take this on the side, y'all. I'm gonna eat these cereal. Make me some good old golden crank cereal now. <laughs> Honey, that oat cereal. I did get some sleep. I feel better. So I did get some sleep. Took me a minute to um, go to sleep last night, but hey, I went. Y'all, when I finished them two burger pounders, double quarter pounders, like when I laid down like five minutes after I ate it, I was still hungry. <laughs> Baby girl. I 
try to lay off red meat. I try to lay off red meat. Cause last time I went to the doctor, they said my I need to start eating so much red meat. And they put me on uh, cholesterol pills that I did. Oh, I only took them for like two weeks. I need to start back taking them, y'all. Right, let's see if this milk. Oh, oh, the due date the nineteenth. Uh, she's still good. Yeah, I just got it out the freezer. Excuse me. Yeah, I love me some good honey and oat Cheerios. I used to didn't like them. I couldn't stand them. I used to have to put sugar in them when I did eat them. If I don't eat this other sound, I eat it for lunch. Y'all, I'm still waiting on that stimulus check. Y'all, I was worried about it, but now I'm just going with the flow. Whenever it comes, it comes. As long as it comes, <laughs> that's all that matters. I think they should have made everybody do get them open up them a bank account or a prepaid card. It would have been easier doing it like that instead of sending it through mail. I'm sleeping, but I'm, I'm really not sleeping, but I, for some reason, I just want to go back to sleep. I don't know why. <laughs> but I woke up, I woke up at 6.40. And I laid back down at probably about 7 o'clock. And then I woke back up. It was, I want to think, 9.50. Yeah, I got a scrape on the side of something. Yeah, since I had, I got my cavities filled probably. I, well, I got my tooth filled first, I mean pulled first over here. And then I got my cavities filled like two months later. And I haven't ate on this side since. And it's been almost a year ago. <laughs> I'll be trying. But y'all, this side right here had a tooth with a hole in it. And I've been having it since I was like 17 years old. It never gave me no problems or nothing. I still ate on this side. But I used to like get something to dig in my teeth and clean it out. Stuff like that. So I just said, I got to go get this teeth pulled. But yeah. But I eat on this side so much. It's starting to hurt. I'm about to go on this side.
Y'all, in my state, South Carolina, they have closed two bars down due to the COV virus. Oh, they're saying it's getting worse or so. Y'all, still stay safe. Yeah, yeah, my cat jumped on my table, and I had that little piece of burger left from last night, and she told my tablecloth up the M M O M J O or whatever it's called, and I threw her outside, and she not coming back in. I don't play that. That's I think y'all. That's why I threw her out my house the first time. She was walking on my counter and shit. Mm -mm. Yeah, the one that just had all the kittens. Oh. Huh. I'm throwing their asses out there, too. All right. I thought she not coming in the house until I get all them kittens out my closet. Mm -mm, I don't play that. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. But see, even though cats, they do, they, that's what they like to do. They like to see how far they can climb. You know, that's what they do. But not in my house, you ain't going to do that. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Now I got clean, sanitized all over again. Even though it's nothing, but still. Oh, y'all, I can chew on this side. But when I, I ain't like it, I ain't never have chewed on this side. But when I chew on this side, I bite my jaw. And I have big gas here in it. Y'all, I want to give a shout out. To a dear, dear friend of mine. She contacted me. And she was going through some things. Well, we actually worked together for like two years, I, get, I think. But we haven't seen each other in probably four years. But we always been contact though. Stayed in contact on Facebook, and she was letting me know what was going on with her. And this this girl been through hell and back. She has a, a son and a daughter, and she contacted me and told me how um, some guy jumped on her. It's it's really her son's father, and he's always been abusive to her, and. You know, just by work, when we worked together, he would come up to the job and scare her and curse her out or watch her or something like that. And to the fact she did not want to walk alone by herself, she would not move unless I move, you know. If I make the first step, she finna make the second step. Like, right? she just, just, we just be this close walking together. That's how scared the girl is. But well, she did finally get away from I think at least two years ago. I mean, he used to beat her, drag her. I think he was start even starting to rape her.
Mind you, she had a, her second child when she was 40, so I think she's like 43 now. 44. But, she caught, anyway, long story short, she contacted me about a week ago. And she said she, um, she finna go in rehab. I'm like, rehab for what? Say she was drinking so much that it started affecting her liver and her body and stuff. You know, I didn't know. I knew she drank, but not like that. But see, I haven't been around her either in a while. But she did. She's doing pretty good. She's been in rehab, I think, 18 days or something like that. I want her to know I'm proud of her. And if any of y'all are going through abuse from any spouse, family member, friend, it's not good. You got to get, I have been in a situation like that myself. Mm -mm. You got to get out and you got to get out fast. I mean, y'all, man, this girl used to cry. Cry every single day before we start working. Uh, she, she'll come and pick me up and she'll bawl and cry. You know. And I thought the guy was just, I thought he was straightening his life up. I thought he was doing good. Being in his son's life. But. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Don't never let nobody treat you like that. And I know that a man is ten times stronger than a woman, but then again, it's a woman that's ten times stronger than a man, too. So... All I want to say is defend yourself any way possible if necessary. Anyway, if you got to, do it. It's like you being in a movie, watching a movie, and somebody trying to kill you, you go stand there and let him kill you or her, whoever. Mm-mm. You either go run or you go defeat yourself. Fast. I should be at right. them quarter pounds, double quarters last night. <laughs> Father's Day coming up, y'all. This will all, this will also be a sad moment for me too. Rest in peace to my father. Up out of here. I bet y'all saying, Why is she seeing like this, y'all? <sighs> but yeah, if you're going through something abusive, any kind of abuse going on in your life, your child life, your family member life. Step up. Yeah, I think to me, the best thing to do is act just as crazy as the abuser. 
I'm telling you, if you act like the abuser, I bet you they'll be scared. milk and it's gonna be a wrap for me take me another little nap <laughs> how many minutes I did 25 minutes all right well just at 11 minutes milk be so good but I really gotta have a taste for milk just to drink like peanut butter and jelly sandwich I I love to drink it with milk and cereal that's the only thing I really like to drink milk with or some kind of sweet cookies or something that was good but y'all, I'm finna go on ahead out of here. I'm gonna talk to y'all later. Y'all have a good day. Don't forget to stay positive. Keep your head up. Stay prayed up. You know what I'm saying? And do your thing. But y'all, I'm gonna holler at y'all later. Peace.